Piilos nyt. <laughs> Oi, me alkaa. Oh. Mä tuodottaa. Mä tiedä. We are so evil. Not giving him any hugs. No hug. No, no hugs. We ain't hugging you. Yeah, just touch it. <laughs> He's like, it doesn't burn you. I didn't know. Didn't know. Okay, and read. In case of a missing rod, if a full set of three rods is unavailable, there is one rod in the inner study room which might work in case the elevator breaks down again. Unless it is absolutely necessary, always use the spare rods in the storage before using mended ones. Okay, Hey, hey, he's slow. Give him a chance to come. Fine. See? No. There's no one there. No. Well, he just wants hugs. No. I said no hug. <laughs> no hug. <laughs> See? 
is not here. Run, 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 <laughs> He's not here. Hey, the music is not about the music. It's not about the music track. Yes. Yeah, it is. There's no one here. Perfectly safe. See? See yeah, so. Where? Well, it's somewhere there. You just have to go past, I think. Yeah, there's a woman. It's a tool, it's a tool. Hello, ah! goodbye. <laughs> Fuck you! And your mother! So we had a ghost because I was at the worst. Go Where did we have away. to run? Up Here. There. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my Fuck. God. Oh my Fuck. Fuck. Oh Fuck this too. That's unfair. Run. <laughs> Not one sick bed. Oh, come on. Oh, I can't be followed through the doors. I am good. No, 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 as it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The yeah. shame will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. Hey. 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 Look at the fountain. It's so relaxing. relaxing. Yes. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> oh, he's uh, suggesting we change our diapers now. Yeah. <laughs> way, way ahead of you. Did it already. We did it already. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Look at this kid. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> so now we got the mechanical room. I think we have everything we need. I guess there will not be any more monsters, please. Oh, there was. I think there was actually. What? Yeah. A. Where were we? A. Closing in. Darkness closing in. What's this? Fourth of July, 1839. Today, I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting aspect was the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may in fact have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. 
Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. Oh. Okay. Uh, that's how they say a pool. Mm. Sally, eight up and eight down. Mm. So. No. Can we. Three. Six. Pussy. Gahdeksan. And that's six. No, that, that can't be it. Because that's six. Yeah, okay. But you don't need to push them all. Okay, that was that was fast. <laughs> no, that was fast. Okay. And what else do we have here? By the way, it's a bed and uh, okay. where we came from so we can turn the valves here but the steam is running down now here. there's cogs here okay so this is where we put the let's see what this is Note that there are only two spare rods left in the storage for the elevator machinery. Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged and keep the others in the inner study room in case all three would crack again. Okay. okay. And we got the one from the inner study room. 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Okay. Oh, it's hard to place. I think so. This one? Yeah. 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 Yeah.